Nice. Fuck yeah, dude. Nice. I love that hook one, dude. That is bad as fuck. That is totally awesome. Hey guys, Jake Vamp here. Big Ben. We're doing another knife unbagging. Which is different Fun from thing. a knife unboxing. Yes, because it comes in a bag. There is no box. I mean, there's probably boxes in here. Just from the feeling of these, so this one's like fairly short, maybe, maybe that size. Mm -hmm. But this one here is really long. Like it's the whole bag. Nice. So. I mean, if it was slightly shorter than this knife here, uh, but not very thick at all. But I'll let you do the, the honors of up and opening it up, checking it out. Alrighty. Knives are one of my favorite things. If it's sharp and shiny, I like it. Even if it's sharp and dull, I like it. <gasps> Bubbles! Yay! We have a box. We have a box. Vortech. Vortech. And another box. But so now, shot knives. Now it's an unboxing. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! All right. So buckshot. Last time we get we got a buckshot. I don't think we got a Vortech. What do you want to? first let's check out this buckshot knife i know hope it's not the same one we'll open it up here oh it's definitely not the same one it's in a plastic bag another unbagging <laughs> we got a uh, kind of a metallic blue with a black and this metallic blue uh, see this metallic blue in here in the middle and on the post here and also on the uh, uh, belt clip here that's pretty cool we got a double edge on the blade oh that's that's an armor piercing um, point right there heck yeah that's pretty neat there's a bl there's a blade edge on both sides here this one and a nice look very sharp, canto though. tip yeah that's not very sharp but that's definitely an armor piercing tip right there oh. It's not sharp, like yeah. at all. That's flat. Okay, they just made it look like it was a double-edged <laughs> knife for some reason. Design. Did you have the? It's very light. Oh, that is really light. That's nice. And is it assisted or? Yep, it's assisted. A little bit, yeah. That is, man. I really like that knife. Yeah. That's a nice. That is nice. I, it really does look like there's a double edge on it. USA designed, crafted in China. 3CR13 steel. That is really good. I like that. What the heck? So I'm looking at this box, and I just looked at the bottom of this box, and I see a California Prop 65 warning. This product can expose you to chemicals which are known to the state of California to cause cancer or birth defects or other reproductive harm. For more information, go to blah, 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 dot com. But wow, yeah. that's weird. Not really. I mean, everything in California causes cancer. So, I mean, it's literally, dude, uh, when we used to live there, we pulled into the parking spot in our new apartment mm -hmm. and that it had that on the wall. Just oh, was, there, was it was your apartment made from asbestos? No, it just said it could cause the parking here could cause cancer. Maybe they used the lead based paint or something. I, I don't know, but it was it was really really odd. Yep. I don't know, but that's a really nice knife. I like it. This one here has a warning on it too. Well, I'm pretty sure that if this knife harmed you, it wouldn't be from the cancer. Yes. All right, you want to do this one? Definitely say that. This is like dragging me down for a second. Sorry, guys. For some reason, the mic is just not cooperating with me. 
Yeah, I'll do this one. Let's see. See the California Prop 65, man. Wow. It's, I don't. I don't even pay attention to that shit anymore because it just everywhere in California, it's everywhere. Ooh, I just accidentally peeked. Well, I guess it wasn't an accident. <laughs> but I'm liking it already. What in the heck? That is a freaking claw, dude. It's a boomerang. What? No. That is a claw. Yeah, that is, that is definitely a claw there. Look at that. Oh my. That is, wow. God. That's tight. Look at that, boy. Woo! That's one. I'm, I'm not gonna do do it because the last time I almost killed you, but you're supposed to like backing away <laughs> subtly. I, I, you have it on your finger like that. Whoa! Yeah, that's tight. Here, check it out. Check it out. It looks like a Velociraptor claw. Oh yeah, it does. That is. Oh my goodness, I love it. And this is what, this is again, uh, I'm pretty sure this is the solid steel all the way down here. You can, there's no give or nothing. It's, wow, this yeah. is very nice. It's got that little pinky ring thing for, uh, I no, think. I ain't even going to try. I'll wind up cutting my thumb off or something, but, uh, wow. Man, that is nice. Now guys, I buy these knives. They're like, it's like $21.95 a month uh, through Blade City. Uh, I'll, I'll try to remember to leave a link down below. Uh, and I'll, I'll do a poll up here. Which knife did you like the best? Do you like the claw? Do you like the armor piercing uh, knife? I think this is one of our best knife unbagging. I love these two knives. Yeah, these are freaking amazing. Yes, both of them are very neat. Uh, this right here now now you, you might be thinking to yourself oh you, it's a raptor claw but this has a very severe point and uh let's say you needed to you know uh get something out of a bag or you know something quickly that's going to be my letter opener from now oh on. yeah this this right here this right here would be just be a quick and it, it it has this ultra piercing because of this downward angle here it has a ultra piercing kind of point to it and uh it's really really a cool design yeah it is and look yeah. at look at the blood the handle itself is is like a, a tactical plastic oh yeah that is and that ring on the bottom cool. for the for the pinky so that way it can't get knocked out of your yeah, hand and you or, can tell it's all the same steel too because you can tell the thickness from right here where it used to be uh how thick it was here and here. Oh yeah. You can, yep. can tell it's the same metal all the way through. That is freaking awesome. This is from dude. Wartech, man. And these guys, these guys sure make some pretty unique knives. That is, that is pretty damn awesome right there. What kind of steel is it? 440 stainless steel. That's, that's not bad. 20 bucks, man. Wow. That's nice city. I am, I am still impressed. And I will still continue to uh, subscribe to your two knives a box, man. This is uh, this is definitely Quality. by far one of my very favorite boxes or bags. Can you see this one again? Yeah, dude. Oh shit! Did... I put Gotta it. watch this guy. <laughs> Damn. It's, a, it's an ultra a nice, light like, design here. Necklace here, dude. This this cool. Uh, uh, metal blue I really like it's got the clip here so you can hook this on your belt and have it whenever you want I uh, used to used to travel a lot and uh, let me tell you nothing comes in handier than a knife when you're on the road and traveling a knife like this to do everything for you you can eat with it you can cut with it you can uh, prepare food with it you can shave with it it's multi i mean it's multiple purposes for a knife and as i sit here trying to invent more ways that i'd probably never use a knife <laughs> i will say that this is a lightweight and 
and and very it has this cool design to where it looks like there's a, a, a an extra edge on it i don't know if you can see that or not but you'll see it in the photo that's, that's a pretty common thing now really? nowadays yeah because see like this this claw here has it too oh yeah i see that it's yeah thinner in the in the top um even 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 this knife right here has like a, oh kind of a little but that's not a blade See here, I, I thought that was an extra well, blade. Like, like, <laughs> see how it's painted red uh -huh. and it's it's bezeled down, uh -huh. sh shaved down to uh, be thinner than everything else on that side. It's just not sharpened. I can run this through uh, my sharpening machine and have it oh, sharpened. Yeah. So. Yeah. Excellent, excellent quality on these knives. I have to give it to you. Very good. Yeah. Bag. Twenty bucks, man. You can't beat that, dude. I would this right here. I would have went into a store and bought it for twenty bucks. Oh, easily, itself. easily. You know that other one for sure. Uh, yeah, <laughs> this one right here is definitely. It would run fifteen, would, twenty bucks. Uh, easy. By itself. Easy. If not more. Better than that, I would imagine, actually, yeah. because it has the custom uh, uh, sheath. Yeah. Very, very nice. And that custom sheath comes with a, a string. You could uh, hook that to something, tie it to something. Uh, yeah. Wow. Pretty awesome. Yeah. Very, very cool, guys. All right. I'll, I'll put a poll up top. Make sure you, uh, you vote which one you like the most. Mm -hmm. If you can decide. Uh, I'll definitely put uh, like a, a section for uh, I like both. Uh, on there so you can pick either the the claw the blue uh, titanium one or both uh, and I think we're gonna just keep shooting some more video and uh, we'll let, be right back let us know what you think in the comments uh, 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 do you get these knife knife bags and if you do uh, what do you think of them uh, I have to say the quality on this one is absolutely excellent um, uh, you know, like, subscribe, don't forget to hit that little notification bell, and we'll see you in the next video. Absolutely love it. Peace, guys.